Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday morning. I am off to uh, paint my mother's mobile home. She's gotten a note in the mail saying that it needs to be painted as per the rental agreement. I kind of knew that was coming. It needed to be painted anyway. I don't think it's ever been painted. It's a 1964 double wide and in some areas it's down to the metal. So I went with her the other day and picked up some paint uh, specifically for metal. Uh, aluminum, uh, an aluminum uh, paint. So uh, it's a primer. And uh, I have a sprayer, but it's not the correct sprayer. I have an HVLP and I went online to see if it's possible to actually use the HVLP. And it says, yeah, but it's not right. It might take a little longer. So I'm going to go over there today with my HVLP and test it because the primer that I'm using is an oil based and it's a thinner than the uh, latex. Latex is very thick and really needs a airless compressor to, to force it out. Um, this is a high volume, low pressure. It uses uh, a, a turbine to blow it out. And it's great for furniture, for doing furniture finishes, but I don't know if it's going to, uh, to uh, put this uh, oil base on there. What I may have to do is rent an airless. So I'm gonna go over to Home Depot first see how much it's going to cost to rent. I've never used an airless compressor either, so a little weary about that. Now, normally my, what I would like to do is to buy one so that I have it and I'm familiar with it and I could use it again, but uh, that's not really an option. I looked at prices uh, and I just don't have the money to pull that off. And I'm thinking it's gonna cost about um, $40 a day to rent one. And the problem, of course, is I don't know how long it's gonna take me to do it. Um, when you do spraying, 99% of, of the work is um, in the preparation. You have, to, uh, you have to tape off everything you don't want sprayed. And uh, that takes quite a long time. So I, I would do that before I actually try and spray. Uh, my, my biggest fear is I'm not going to have time because come this weekend I'm supposed to go uh, house sit for Nikki and John to see what I can do today. Alright, so here I am. I'm at my mother's uh, mobile home and this is the back wall of the mobile home. It's almost completely void of paint. It's just aluminum. It's been washed already and um, I need to tape off the bottom part because it's plastic and it's not going to stick and this is my sprayer it's a it's a relatively old HVLP I'm gonna have to see exactly what I need to get this to work or if it'll work at all and uh, so I'm gonna tape and we'll check that out So this is my primer. Um, it is a interior exterior galvanized aluminum paint. So gal galvalume premium. It should go on pretty easily. I haven't opened it yet to see how thick it's going to be. I have some paint thinner to thin it because it needs to be thinned with paint thinner. I have my uh, sprayer all hooked up and I'm ready to go. And I will give it a try. All right. So I'm just leaving my mom's place and I didn't get much anything done. It's kind of par for the course. It happens a lot. Uh, I opened a can of paint and it's an oil-based paint because the guy thought that was the best way to go working with uh, aluminum siding and the uh, paint was so separated that it would not mix and um, I checked the date on the can and it was two and a half years old. We had to take it back 
and uh, they were all well it has a, a three-year uh, a shelf life man so well obviously it doesn't or it's older than it says but uh, yeah they uh, we said uh, can we get it mixed can we get a chicken this is no because it's oil based and it might explode great so I said but we'll mix it for you so yeah okay so they opened up like another can and they were gonna saying they were gonna open a new one but they pulled out another two and a half year old can same date on it and it was just as separated so they gave us a a water base this time which I would rather work with but it also means that I am not going to be able to use my HVLP I'm gonna to have to uh, get a hold of a, an airless compressor somehow and, uh, so I'm heading home I'm gonna to talk to my wife uh, I might pick something up she's not feeling well as I said and uh, that was the day Sorry you didn't see too much of Val today, but she hasn't been feeling well. I have a migraine. It's because he yells all the time. Me? Do I? Mm -hmm. I never yell. Mm -hmm. You're the yeller. Mm -hmm. All yeller over here. You gonna put me down? No. It's because I foam at the mouth every now and then. Just a bit of. Okay. <laughs> anyway, if you enjoyed hanging out with us today. Yeah. Yes. Please give us a great big thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, please hit that little red subscribe button down below. You're shaking the camera. And help your neighborhood community to grow. Mm. And share this video with everybody you know. Oh, a lot of O's in this closer. Even people you don't know. Oh. And we'll see you all tomorrow. Bye. Because I'm going to go to sleep now. Bye. Bye.